Got a moment? Hey, Meyer. I could use your help. Have you checked the job board lately? Judging from your tone, it's something serious, not just another bandit problem, right? Yes. One of my men deserted his post. Oh, that's serious. Who was it? That's what pisses me off. It was a friend. A guy named Bart. Maybe it's my fault. I know he had it rough here. I tried to protect him. I guess it wasn't enough. You protect him? From who? The other soldiers. They... had a problem with him. Which was... Their problem, not Bart's. Believe me, I know what it's like to be the odd man, or woman, out in old-school military culture. But here's my problem. Desertion alone will get him the death penalty. But what he took could get others, good men, killed. What did he steal? Let's call it a map. That's all I can tell you. The rest is on a need-to-know basis only. And you don't need to know. You need me to track him down? Yes. With everything going on, I just don't have the manpower to spare. But I must get that map back. Okay, I get the map. But what about Bart? When you bring the map back, just tell me where he is and leave the rest to me. It's my job. Okay, where should I start looking? Try his bunk. It's in the barracks, a deck above us. Can I ask anyone about Bart? Sure, he was pretty well known, whether he liked it or not. He was popular among the new recruits. Try asking Mateo. He's usually hanging around the armory. Then there's Magda. Never had a kind word to say about Bart. Nor anyone, for that matter. She works in the hospital on the next floor. Okay. I think I can take it from here. Good luck, Aiden. Our chances against renegades were pretty good, but now I'm not so sure. Let me go. I'm innocent. What a sweet, sweet killing machine! It's like a PK buffet of supplies, right? X marks the spot. Yes, there it is. Set sail Jesus, back to me Mateo, too. your excitement's creeping me out. Hey, uh, you Mateo? We've met. New Dawn Park. You were looking for Lieutenant Rowe. You saved me from the Renegades. Oh, right. Uh, listen, Mateo. Meyer sent me. I'm looking for Bart. Bart? Uh, thanks for saving me and all, but I can't help you with Bart. I just want to... No, sorry. I haven't run across him for a while anyway. Try Garrett. I saw him walking toward the barracks. Jeez. Okay, okay, I'm leaving. Hey, you! Want to be sent back to the Outlands? Keep that biomarker in plain view. Rainer's men got a huge order. We'll talk later. Huh? I'm beating it. You, Garrett? I'm trying to find Bart. I hear you know him. Maybe. That depends. You friend or foe? Uh, undecided. Cute. Listen, you can count me as one of Bart's friends. And as for those rumors that Bart's done something wrong, total bullshit. Bullshit? Give me a break. Whatever's going on, it's a setup. I'm sure the other PKs are behind this. Which PKs? throw a rock, you'd probably hit one, and it'd bounce off and hit another, and so on. How would they set up one of their brothers like this? <sighs> Don't believe everything you hear about dignity and brotherhood around here. I see. So you know where Bart might be? I don't. But even if I did, don't know if I'd tell you, Mr. Undecided. Right. Well, thanks for the insight. He's always 
pushing himself to the limit. And these are the consequences. Excuse me, ma'am. Can you help me? Who are you ma'aming? What do you want? I'm busy. I'm trying to find someone. A, a man named Bart. Are you familiar with him? Bart? <laughs> Fuck yes. Don't get me started. Ah, so you know him. Yep. But I got no time to talk to you, especially about a perv like Bart. Besides, boss says I gotta watch my mouth. <laughs> That's bullshit if you ask me. Can't tell me anything? I just did, you moron. Do I have to spell it out for you? People like that shouldn't be around children, if you ask me. But that's all I'm saying. Oh, I see. Thank you. Excuse me, what is this place? How can you not know? Wait. Are you that pilgrim? It depends. I remember you. You brought me the letter from Leon. I didn't introduce myself. But my name is Kyra. Leon? My condolences. He was a great man, an excellent soldier. Like everyone in Squad 404. Squad 404? Haven't you heard of them? They were legendary. They were the ones who helped get Frank out of the VNC Tower. They were the ones who defended the Missy when the infected got inside. They were role models for every PK. And at this point, we should honor their memory. How do you know Squad 404 so well? I was their radio operator. I heard the last blows they got. And their last words. I can still hear them. In my dreams. But that's a good thing, you know? Because we mustn't forget them. And this place. The PK should honor their memory here, just like they did with the others who fell. I know what you mean. To remember. It's our duty. Pilgrim. May I ask something of you? Will you help me collect them? Collect all the dog tags of Squad 404. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. You already met some of them. Fitzbowski, Chris and Lieutenant Rowe in the VNC Tower. I already got the dog tags from the men in the VNC Tower. As for the rest of the squad, here are the action reports. You already know what to do. I'm sure the brothers and sister would like to be reunited. Aren't you going? I thought you wanted to help them.
You shouldn't be here. PK barracks are off limits to civilians. Can I ask you a question? Okay. But then scram before we both get in trouble. Um, looking for a guy named Bart. You know him? Sure do. He's famous. <laughs> Not in a good way. Have you been acting suspicious or anything lately? I don't know. Never met him, actually. Fresh off the boat as of today. Ah, <laughs> uh, got it. Uh, thanks. Yeah. Hope you find him. I'd be happier knowing I don't have to bunk with a guy like that. Interesting. I'll keep looking. So, I'm looking for a guy named Bart. You seen him? Can't say that I have, son. And I'm sorely disappointed. Why is that? Kind of hard, General Saul. A little out of place here, to be honest. Was with us for about a year. A cut above the typical military Neanderthals around here. He was kind, but not weak. Stood up to the bullies, whether the bullies were targeting him or younger recruits. I've seen him get a bloody nose defending the greener recruits from being hazed. But, as they say, you should have seen the other guys. Hazing incidents have gone down since Bart's arrival. There's some crazy rumor going around about Bart that has Mayer up in arms. But I don't buy it. Bart wouldn't go rogue. It's not in his nature. When you do find him, I'm sure he'll have a reasonable explanation for all this. If I can find him. Well, his bunk is right here. Take a look. Maybe you'll find something to help you. A good idea. Thanks. Find something? So what did you find, son? Hmm. You know anything about this? Not really, but it's good. Bull cream work, if you ask me. Who drew it? Couldn't tell you. I've seen Bart with pictures like this off and on over the last year. But as far as I know, he doesn't have children of his own. Ah, uh, children. Mine are all grown. Not all are still alive either, sadly. But I remember when they were young and happy, drawing constantly. They scribbled their way through boxes and boxes of crayons. The kid who drew that, he's a happy kid. Well, if Bart doesn't have kids, where'd he get it? Probably child of a friend or something. He was kind to everyone. Here, there, everywhere. Unless you were a bully. Hmm. Well, this doesn't help. Now what do I do? You might ask Stack over at the canteen. Seen them together a few times. Bart helped him when he was in some trouble. Helped everyone a lot. Thanks. I'll go talk to that stock. Doc, I was told you know Bart. Who doesn't know Bart? What's this all about, anyway? He left his post. He's accused of desertion. Son of a bitch. He finally went for it. Good for him. Good for them. If I were you, I'd just leave him be. We all should. This probably happened because Meyer can't keep a leash on her men. You hear any other bullshit about Bart? 
Well, he's been accused of theft. Well, that's nonsense, that is. Bart is honest as the day is long. He's got no reason to steal from anyone. And the CEO doesn't want to believe it either. You mean Meyer? Hmm. That's all I've been told. Trust me, a lot of other PK have had it in for Bart since day one. Meyer's respected, mostly. But when it came to Bart, her men refused to follow her lead. I trust you, so I'll tell you this. Bart's loyal military, but he had another side. Like the outdoors, always out near the fields. Ask the field workers on top of the old office building at the intersection of Van Peel and St. Paul Boulevard. It's right here in New Dorn Park. Thanks, I'll do just that. about the only time I smile. Your bottle smash? for Bart. Can you tell me anything about him? Oh, well, for one, you're not his type. Wait, wait, what? Relax, honey. I was just pulling your leg. The look on your face, my. To answer your question, I can tell you that Bart is as fine a man as I've ever known. High praise, I know, but I'm not just talking his looks. He's brave, kind, caring, loves children, especially Andy's son, Liam. Andy? Bart's bestie, Andy. Those two are like two peas in a pod. And Liam, he's, well, like a spring pea, I guess. How Bart dotes on that boy. Hmm, so where can I find him? Probably at Andy's. They had a few of us up for some cool drinks just yesterday. Such kind souls. Up? Where? Andy's place is over there, not far. You can get there quicker if you're any good at climbing. Yeah, <laughs> good to know. Thanks a lot. My pleasure. You tell those boys I said hi. This belongs to. It can't be far. Hmm. Just like the one I found in Bart's bunk. Must be Liam's work. Fresh fingerprints in the dust on these keys. Someone was playing this recently. Huh. Steve. What does this mean? Looks like I'm in luck. Let's have ourselves a little chat. Introductions are in order. Your Bart, I presume. No, uh, why do you ask? Oh, then you must be Andy. Nope, wrong again. Then stop wasting my time and tell me who you were. A competitor, apparently. Uh, so you're after Bart too? I am. Huh? She must be really Jones, and for what Bert stole, she's harder than any old Tom, Dick, or Hardy. I didn't realize this was a horse race either. Normally, situations like this piss me off. But if Meyer hired us both, it means we're on the same side and can share intel. 
Zo. Die zie je teken op hem nam Bert. Nada. Besides, not sure how being hired by the same person makes us partners suddenly. They get the fuck out of my way and let me work. Doc, Aiden here. You familiar with some guy named Steve? You mean Slippery Steve? What's he got to do with Bart? I don't like the sound of that. But sure, I know Steve. Haven't you met him? He comes to the canteen most nights. Stay close to your radio. I'll let you know when he shows up. You two can have a chat then. Thanks, Doc. Aiden out. It's about the only time I smile. And then I see the goddamn UV lights. I'm close to the gym, Kyra. Any idea where to find Bartas's body? Bartas is bound to have fallen near a swarm of slain enemies. Anyway, listen for yourself. Don't you find it strange that a group of Bazarians wants to hand us over an injured PK in a place like this? Take it easy, Auntie. How many times do I have to tell you? Don't call me Auntie! Private first class Bartez is depressing enough! Sure thing, Auntie! that many myself. Respect. Kyra, I'm near the GRE lab. Pilgrim, you better wait until night time. It's probably swarming with infected during the day. Where do I look for the bodies? You'll learn everything from the recording. I can't listen to it. Over and out. Little Ron the base. The exit downstairs is jammed, so we're gonna try and find a way out of the top. <laughs> Sierra and I found Private Kitty in the lobby on the lowest level. <laughs> oh, oh, what's that stink? Kitty, did you just far. Is that how happy you are to see us? What? No, I didn't. <laughs> we missed you, punk. <laughs> did you hear that? We better get our asses out of here. Admit it, Sierra. You're the one who farted and tried to blame me. <laughs>
cards, scrawling his name on the Jokers.
Sorry, I gotta take this. Tough son of a gun, weren't you?
younger than me. Kyra, I'm in this radio station. Any tips on where to look for the bodies? I'm sorry. It was so terrible I brushed it out of my memory. One moment. There. It's the last thing I was able to record. Generators activated. Only got the antenna left. Cool. Listen, Brasco. I know Sierra's death hit you hard. I just want you to know. You can always count on me, man.
those renegade rats could have been capable of pushing you in here. got away. Almost. <laughs> 